be in a position where it could go it alone. There could be another indie rep and Scotland then subsequently join the EU. And if it does, does it have to accept the euro? Well, first of all, I'm, as, a, as a non political advisor, I'm not really sort of privy to a political strategy. So I can only sort of give you the, the response that uh, is, is normally in the press that it's, a, it's, it's, a, it's an issue which the Scottish Government has decided to reserve the possibility of an on the NDRF. In terms of accession to the EU, this debate was had uh, at the time of the first independence referendum. I, I personally don't have any doubts that, that an independence Scotland could be part of, uh, of, of the EU. It would be accepted uh, as part of the EU as, uh, as any other candidate uh, country. Uh, and certainly, uh, as we know from other countries around the EU at the moment, like Poland and Sweden, adopting the euro is not a, is not a compulsory requirement, even though it's part of the, part of the treaties. Okay, uh, well, that's up for debate, isn't it? But we've run out of time, so we'll debate that next time we speak to you. For now, thank you very much indeed for joining us on Sky News Live at 5. Thank you.